of the imager is very important for a number of different reasons. One of them relates to lens quality. Now, HDTV, uh, you may think of it as having, let's say, 1920 picture elements per line and 1080 lines per frame in uh, one of the most popular formats of HDTV. But lenses don't deal in terms of television lines. They deal in terms of line pairs per millimeter of image. So the larger the image is, the more millimeters you have to deal with, and the fewer line pairs per millimeter the lens has to deal with. In a two-thirds inch image sensor, what we call a two-thirds inch image sensor, it has an 11 millimeter diagonal, and the width of the sensor is 9.6 millimeters. So if we're talking about HDTV that has 1920 picture elements per line, then it has 960 line pairs. A line pair is a white line and a black line, so there's um, one line pair for every two pixels. And 960 divided by 9.6 millimeters is a nice round number, 100 line pairs per millimeter. Now, if you look at something like a one-third inch image sensor, if it's also doing 1920 picture elements per line, then you have almost twice as many line pairs per millimeter. You have close to 200 line pairs per millimeter. Well, that means that the lens that's on a one-third inch imager actually has to be almost twice as good as the lens that's on a two-thirds inch imager to give you the same quality. That's very difficult to do. That's one of the reasons why sensor size is important. There are other issues relating to um, wide angles and relating to sensitivity and dynamic range, and I'll discuss some of those in a moment.